so we're gonna kinda put together a hay trailer out of an old truck bed. So we're just gonna stick this running gear, we're gonna put it together and get some tires through on it. And throw that on top of the running gear. Throw some wood on the bed. Put side and then just have a hay trailer. Because we're kind of running out of trailer space for hay. You can kind of see what I'm talking about. And the alfalfa is ready to be cut again. So we need a trailer to put the hay on. And we don't really want to unload it off of that other trailer because we don't have a permanent home for the hay. And we're kind of selling it off the trailer, so. One tire mounted, one to go. Yeah, we got a leak in the tube. <sighs> Tires. They never seem like they want to hold air. So we have a 15 here that'll bolt up to it that is actually off of that trailer. I think it's an implement tire. And it's a 15. So I'll have two, six, two 15s on the back and then two 16s up front. So it'll be close enough I guess doesn't look like any leaks on this side thinking leaks Yeah, we might have to take it off and clean the room up and reseat the bead. Good news, actually held there. Alright, so we got all the tires on. 
everything's ready to go. We're just gonna kind of guess here and weld it up and then throw the frame on there. Some were cracked, so I welded those up. Yeah, it turned out pretty good, so. I just got to pick through all this and find some good ones to throw on there. Alright, so we got the boards here. We got some good ones. And we're going to take it back to the shop, cut them to length, set them in there, and then use some self tapping screws on the end. Do a row in the middle and then the back. And that should be good. So, got them all cut. Um, and say she turned out pretty good.